All right, guys, welcome back. Look what we got here today. This is a robot lawnmower. This is the Luba from my Motion Tech. And I'll be showing more of this in the future, but today we're going to be showing the wireless RTK function of it, where it doesn't need a wire or a fence. Uh, it does a kind of a locator boundary. I'll show you in a second here. I just wanted to point out real quick before we get started, all that noise in the background is not the robot. There's a guy over there working with the loader. So I just wanted to clarify that. So, what we're going to do here is, first of all, we're going to open up the app. And I um, hope you're going to be able to see that well. So this is the Luba app to control the mower. And you press enter map and it does a GPS of your location. There it says Bluetooth connection successful. Now it's showing an old an old boundary that I did. I'm going to be doing that over again to do a bigger one. So what you do as you can see the map there is the uh, GPS map but um, it needs to be more precise than that so they're using this uh, locator tower and let's give this a try so what we want to do here is we want to create a new map a new uh, track a new square to mow in so we're going to press that we're going to create a new task I'll call it uh, 9. Confirm. And here it says you can start drawing the boundary. And so what you do is you drive it with these controls here in the, and you show it where you want to, uh, the perimeter that you want it to mow in. And so uh, I will do that right now. Now normally, they say to just walk around behind it and uh, do it that way, but I think I can do it right from here. Um, maybe I will follow it. So let's do that. Okay, and the final part of it I wanted to show you. See, it has drawn three sides of that as I just drove three sides. And I'm about to close it. Hopefully I can show that happening. Just a little bit more. And there. So you have success. You have completed the square. And now what you want to do is back it up just a little bit you got to make sure it's inside that square to start mowing and I think it is so hold on one moment I'll turn the other camera on okay so now you can see so I'm gonna hit this button here and that brings up the play button over here. Press that. Takes you to this screen. It says start operation down here. So we'll press that. And there it goes. And so you'll see it's following. Oh, I won't block the view. 
But I do have another camera on it, so I'll show the entire operation from that one. But as you can see, it's following the square. See there? And it's doing its rows. Now something that I can show you here. Now it's mowing all the way up right now, but you have this option up here to lower the blade. See there? Minus, minus. So we'll go minus, minus. We'll take it all the way down to like 35 so that maybe we can yeah hear it and it will go lower than that I can try to go a little bit lower we will go to now we're at 25 There's its progress, and I'll show you the whole thing from the other camera view, so I'm not interrupting. See, I'm absolutely not touching anything. It's mowing automatically. Now, it looks like it's getting close to the end of its square there. See there? And there we go. So, how about that, huh? So this is the Luba. Hold on a second, let me turn this camera off and I'll get to the next scene. There's the start operation down here. So we'll press that. There it goes. So you'll see it's following I do have another camera on it, so I'll show the entire operation from that one. Thank you. 
Thank mm -hmm. you.